Now, in BTC, uh, I, as I've highlighted previously, I am very positive. We do need to highlight this first. Again, you always have to, have to look at context. This is a monthly flag that is forming in BTC on the monthly. On the, on the weekly, if we now overlay, uh, overlay the drawings, there's a possible higher low here, a, a trough that is due on the intermediate term, 11.4 to 12.2. Uh, you're seeing that, that clear flag form on the weekly as well. Uh, so watch to see if we can put in that higher low, build some energy here, and then get that breakout to the upside uh, here in uh, in Bitcoin. Uh, if we jump over to the daily chart, there's a short-term drop that's due 11.7 to right around 11.20, generally in line with the overall market. This one yielded a very nice uh, move off of that minor trough. You can see that very clearly. And now we're going to be watching to see if this just really chops around a little bit by its time. If so, that would be, you know, I would say interesting and set up a move back to the upside. We're seeing some great action still in names like MSTR and BLOK. Again, these are some uh, some names that are and have been on our radar uh, for trade ideas, and we've highlighted them in office hours. Uh, so very nice action. Going to be watching for this to be a flag here and then curl its way back to the upside. But very interested in this, uh, this really nice weekly flag in addition to monthly flag uh, that is forming here. Uh, in BTC. This is really an important you know, uh, signal to be watching for is for a retest of that zone, that flag to get uh, formed, then for this to actually break out with some power to the upside. Uh, so that's what I will be watching for. I, you know, I'm just really you know, just allowing this to bide its time, do what it needs to. If it wants to get sold one more time with the overall U.S. market, fine, and then see what it can do once that next draw forms. Uh, we have many lows that are due in crypto names around that that same timing, right? So that's why uh, I think there are good odds for a dip into that zone, and then let's see what uh, what this can do on the upside.